hello and welcome to my channel. This is Paper Play with Julie K. And today I have a box that I received from Shonda, who is Slim Cards here on YouTube. And Shonda and I had decided to kind of shop each other's stash um, for some supplies. And how it originally turned out is I had purchased a few things at Tuesday morning and she had purchased a couple things at Tuesday morning and we decided to kind of split the paper. And then um, it kind of turned into where we decided to go ahead and send some other extras along with that paper that we had decided to split. And so um, literally just kind of shopping each other's stash. And our plan is to um, try and make a couple of things with the items that we sent each other. So she will also be posting, if she hasn't already, on the box that I sent her. And so what we each did is we put um, the paper that we had agreed upon that we were splitting, but then we just went through our stash and threw in stuff that we thought each other would like or stuff that would match um, the paper that we sent. And so I know when I sent her her package, I literally just opened up all my different drawers and different crafting boxes and I just pulled items out of kind of each thing. Um, so here is the box that Shonda um, sent me and um, or all the items in the box, um, which the box was quite heavy, um, lots of paper, so it was kind of fun and very fun to open. I've kind of taken a little bit of a peek, but I haven't gone through everything. So some of the stuff is gonna be a surprise for me and some of it I kind of knew about. And so um, here is the first item that um, Shonda sent. It's some really pretty lace trim and I didn't know that she was sending this, but she knows um, how much I really love trim and this actually looks kind of vintage in some ways, um, but really pretty trim. It's kind of a pale, um, pale green. It's really pretty, nice pastel color. And then she also said she had picked me up um, this Crafter's Companion Diet Tuesday morning. Um, it was one that I had gone into on my Tuesday morning to look for and our store didn't have it. So I'm really excited that Shonda did purchase that one for me. Um, I just think that would be really cute on a lot of different cards or when you're making things for Happy Mail for people that that would be really a nice um, sentiment to add to things. She sent me some little um, resin frames really cute. And then she picked me up some Bow Bunny um, chipboard, um, which I don't have this one, Shonda, so thank you for that. And then some um, little ephemera pieces from Bow Bunny. And this one comes from the Bella Rosa Paper Company. And I do believe I sent her some paper from this company, or from the Bella Rosa Paper Collection in what I sent her. Um, she sent me this huge um, baggie full of journaling cards, which I think that's one of the things I didn't put in her package, uh, mostly because I was too lazy to um, grab my journal cards or Project Life cards off of the shelf. So I don't think I sent her any um, but there looks like some really nice ones in there. I mean, I'd use these all the time in my journals and stuff as little spots to journal on. So some really nice ones. And I don't have um, whatever brand these ones are, so that's fun. Um, some different ones than what I already own. So thank you for that, Shauna. She sent me some blank tags, which I definitely can use. And then just some bigger Project Life cards. Um, but some really pretty ones. Thank you so much. <clears throat> and then let's see, um, some more trim, which I was really excited about this when I saw earlier, um, Shonda had gifted me some uh, similar trim, but different colors. And this one is in black. Um, so I really love this one. I'm gonna hoard this one, I think, until Halloween and use it on some Halloween projects. Um, but that one's really pretty. Um, she sent me some yellow and blue in this one already, I think. Um, and I've already used some of the yellow that she sent me earlier. Oh, she sent me some really cute little butterflies. Really pretty. Actually some, a couple different colors in there, so that's really nice. 
Let's see. Um, the next item that she sent me is okay, some little stick pins. Oh, those are pretty in the pink color. Sorry about the glare. It's kind of later in the evening here and I'm recording, so I get kind of bad glare. Um, and then she sent me some little brettes, but these are fun to take apart and just use as embellishments on things. Um, so she sent me a couple different colors. So very fun. And let's see another package of kind of some miscellaneous paper here. So these are little cutout letters. And that's what it looks like, um, just lots of different colors in here. So that was, they'll be fun to use. So thank you, Shonda, for that. And then um, here's the pile of paper. And some of these I think I knew about and some of these I didn't that um, she sent. Um, I don't think I knew about um, she, this one was a Graphic 45. This is that sport collection one. I'm really cute. I don't actually own any of this paper at all from that collection. So very fun. And then I think this was also from that same sport collection, but all the cut aparts on that one. So really nice. And then here's some of the Gilded Lily um, ones, which that's really pretty on the background of that one. I have a few sheets of like the cutouts from this one that another friend had gifted me when she bought big packages at Tuesday morning. But I really like that one. That one's really pretty. Oh, this is fun. Um, a Meet Me in Paris. So she must have, it looks like, picked this one up at Tuesday morning. Um, oh, really pretty paper in there. Nice vintage. There's some gold foil in it. Kind of shabby chic also really pretty thank you that's going to be fun to you shonda and this one is calendar cards bingo cards so that's kind of fun i've never seen those before so she sent me a pile of those probably be able to use those in some of my journaling stuff Oh, and then she, it looks like she got some of the Graphic 45. This is from the Come Away With Me collection. And these are the um, cutout parts. And again, I don't, I have some of this collection, but I don't have um, any of the cut aparts. So thank you for that. And this is one of the ones I knew about that we had talked about trading. Um, she picked up this one off to the races collection and this was the My Fair Lady page with all the vintage women on it that will be definitely be fun to um, cut apart these women and use them on all sorts of different projects. So thank you so much for that. I love this page. And our Tuesday morning didn't get this page in. So that was fun that she was able to trade that one with me. And then our store also, at least not that I saw, um, got um, this Sare um, Bow Bunny paper collection in and she was able to find it. So um, this is one of the items I did know was coming, but it's just beautiful. It's kind of shabby and it's vintage. Um, but I mean, even if you just cut out this part and use it for something, this is still nice, very nice background paper over here to do a lot of different things on that. And then the back side of that one has keys on it. So really pretty on the back side of that one also. Then here's another um, one from the Sorry collection that, again, my Tuesday morning store, at least I never saw that it came in, but her store got it. And this was the cut of parts, which was so fun um, that she got. So thank you, Shonda, for that. Um, really fun cut of parts. And then the backside's kind of vintage on that one also. So really nice. And then... These ones I didn't know about, so um, let's see. This one is called Bring In Bloom, and it's part of the Donna Salzar collection from GCD Studios. But some more nice cut aparts on that one. Kind of some spring and butterflies. So really pretty. And then the background kind of actually looks like a kind of a nice fall colored page on the background of that one. 
really cute. And then this one, oh, this one's pretty too. Um, this one's called Artistic Papers from GCD Studios. Again, it's part of the Donna Salazar collection. Um, but some nice vintage stuff on this one. So really pretty. Thanks so much, Shonda, for doing this little shop your stash swap with me. It was really fun, and it was kind of fun to see what you sent me from your stash. And I really hope that everyone watching will go and check out Shonda's channel, which I will link below in the description box, um, because she does have a video out, or will, of um, what I sent her when she shopped my stash. And then if Later on, if you check back on our channels, we will be posting videos of what we created with each other's stash. Um, so hopefully we'll all both see you back then to um, see what we created. But until then, everyone have a wonderful day and happy crafting.